Americans are flipping out saying that we have no jobs for Americans right. and these and these filthy Easterners are taking all of our jobs and everything. But then Bull. again, when you get the report from them, they're saying the same they're thing. They're saying the same thing. Right. So it's like an all around, you know, it, world everybody kind of screwed. I mean, it, unfortunately, and, and that's that new world order that's coming through that oh, wants God. to completely take it. No, again, you know, <laughs> and you know, I'm not gonna go super ranting because I want to catch more honeybees, you know, more but but them. what it's about is again, we need a wake up up from what's going on and they're slowly taking over. I think just people need to wake up and realize that things aren't the same anymore. No, and unfortunately will it ever we're, be? We're, we're we no, change. you know what? And that's the mentality that everybody has. Well, now you're right. If change, we change we it. Vote for change? I didn't vote. I voted for it's, it's kind of productive. It's like people want a change of anything that is bad. Hey! And that is the change. man that's going to help us. Bullshit! <laughs> It's the same damn know. party. I think it would still the Clintons. Oh, it is going to take a long time. But you need people. I mean, regardless if it was Barack Obama or if it was uh, you know the other people. Uh, uh, I can't McCain, even remember his name now. Kaylin, yeah, Kaylin, 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 Kaylin. 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 Even if they came in, and, and it would be the same thing. And it's the same. same. And Christine is right. It would have taken a while, but at least. There are people who are saying, "All right, whatever we're doing now is not working. It's time to start putting in a change." Um, but people. People want to hold on to the good things that were, even when those are expired and they're gone. So you have, you know, this lifestyle that America had of itself, so big screen TVs and big giant suburban vehicles, gas guzzling vehicles. They loved it and they want it, the good old days. Mm -hmm. And now when you're saying, hey man, there isn't enough money and enough credit for you to buy that big TV. You can't have it. you got to settle with a little 32 inch black and white. And oh. no, you can't have a big giant suburban, you got to drive a little go-kart smart car to conserve on gas, people don't want that, man. They're resistive to that kind of change. They want the good old days. Yeah, you know, and that's yeah. the thing is the that right, the Europeans the, don't want have it. changed over to that. I mean, we're well, pretty never much had what well, we right, but, but, but they they're on the smart cars or whatever, and where Americans are still resisting that, unfortunately. But you know what? I think we should be resisting that. We are the home Why? of the brave. Funny, the thing. But things aren't even the same back in the eighties to now or the nineties. You know yeah, the what? The boxes. I mean, come on, man. I love that <laughs> stuff. Right. That oh, bat. you you want to keep your ghetto blast? You want your double D's, right? Your double D batteries. I want, yeah, yeah, I want the ghetto blast. You can't that, have that, that now. Like eight hundred no pounds. There's no energy for that. Three double D batteries. Thirty batteries. Thirty batteries and one battery.